Hello, good day, everybody. This is your host, Clover, the host of Clover Hello Sports, but I'm live right here at Leesburg, Virginia, Lowell County area. Today, ladies and gentlemen, get you guys into the big news. The Don Mitchell just got traded to, to the uh, Cavs, by the way. Marcus Mays was arrested and charged for aggravated assault with a firearm from a road rage incident, by the way. Cavs Ventura celebrated his 36th birthday in Texas. Marta Kostya refused to shake uh, Victoria Zarenka's hand, by the way, over Russia attacking the Ukrainians. Gives you guys the fact that Rafa Nadal fights off a um, a cut on his nose as he advances in the second round of the 2020 U.S. Open, by the way. Paige Beckers is going to be returning for 2023-24 season. And Serena v Venus, they got they got wiped out at the first round of, of the women's doubles in the 2020 U.S. Women's Open. U.S. US Open. So, and that's all the, and many others just come out of the way, guys. All right, first thing, sir, I'm going to start things off with the big news that Don Mitchell got traded to the Cavs and a huge, massive offer. The Jazz, they get Laurie Marquette, Markinen, Oche Abagji, Colin Sexton, by the way, and the Cavs, unprotected first-round picks in 2025, 2027, and 2029. Also, there's going to be pick swaps in 2026 and 2028. Sexton is going to sign a four-year, 72 mil fully guaranteed off for a part of the sign and trade agreement with the Jazz. And Mitchell's going to be 26 next week. Whoa. I mean, I thought Don Mitchell's going to the Knicks. That didn't happen. That did not happen. Instead, he's going to be filling LeBron's shoes. He's going to be in Cleveland, Cleveland with the Cavs. And the Jazz, they may not be legit contenders anymore in the playoffs. I'll tell you about that. Don Mitchell, man, he's he's with the Cavs. He can make he made the Cavs legit contenders yet again. But could he really get a brass ring there, like LeBron did? Let me know about that, everybody. How do you what do you, what do you, how do you feel about Don Mitchell going to the to the Cavs? Let me know about that, right? You think he should have gone to the Knicks? Let me know, everybody. I'll address response to that. Another thing I'm gonna get you guys into, by the way, that um Marcus Mann got arrested and charged for aggravated assault with a firearm from a road rage incident in Metairie. He got released on a third from custody on a 30k bond. He will he was in a same pra Saints practice. May was ID'd as the uh, driver of a black SUV that got to the road rage incident where he pointed a firearm at another ride by several juvenile females. But May denies the incident, by the way. So that's all this for that. And um, court date could be in, in November 24. So that's all this said about that, everybody. Another news that um. Cassie Ventura just celebrated her 36th birthday in Texas at a town, at um, H me H Town nightclub, party with James Harden, John Moran, Terrence J, Pleasure P, Jay Mulan, Alary, Jake, Kleos, Scra Scraya, and Neo and Neo. They were all there as well. So what a big moment that is. I'll tell you about that. Another news that um, Marta. Kostiwick refused to shake Victoria Zarenka's hand, by the way, because due over Russia, Belarus's attack on the Ukrainians. So um, that's all that you need to know about that, right? And um, yeah, Marta Kostiwick, she's been vocal on Russia's attack on the Ukraine, and um, that's a big deal, and, and that's been ongoing for weeks. Another news that um, Iga Swiatek defeats Sloane Stephens in the third round of the 2020 U.S. Open. Another news that Rafa Nadal. Just fought through a cut on his nose in the second round of the 2020 US Open, by the way. And also, guys, uh, Serena Williams and Venus, they lost in the women's doubles tournament in the US, U, at the um, 2020 US Open, in the women's doubles at the 2020 US Open. So, and look at the, also, guys, another news that um, Paige Beck is just going to be returning for 2023 24 season, by the way. From, she's going she to be returning for next year from an injury that she sustained. And honestly, um, she she is age eligible to be in the WNBA draft. So that's all the system about that. And other news, unless she gets there. And other news that uh, changes my mind. This. Another news that I'm um, earning. Ernie Shavers is gonna. Ernie Shavers died at 78. He was 74, 14 and to one with with 68 KOs in his career. Fought Muhammad Ali and uh, Larry Holmes for the heavyweight title. He fought Gary Clooney. Ron Lyle and Cleveland Williams, by the way, as well. So, my thoughts and go to Ernie Shavers' family members and his fans and viewers of the box community of this horrific loss. He was 78 at the time. Very clear what he died of. That's all there's you got to know on that. Also, another news that um, 
Dirk Nowitzki's jersey is going to be retired in Germany. So what a big one this for him. Another guy's another news that um, Harold Landry has a torn ACL not looking good. He could be out for a season. Also, guys, some other news, another news I want to get you guys into, by the way, that um, Argentina and VP Christina Fernandez de Kirchner had a gun pointed at her by a man at a um, who was arrested. Excuse me, guys. And that man. Sorry, buddy. That man was arrested for pointing the gun at the Argentina VP, by the way. So, um. The Argentina games have been, soccer games have officially been canceled for now. That's all there's need to know. And it's very unknown if um, they're going to start yet again. Who knows, guys? Also, guys, don't forget that um, Clash of the Castle is tomorrow, by the way, guys. That's all you got to know with that. You'll see Drew McIntyre take out Roman Reigns for the undisputed WWE Universe title. You'll also, and also, guys, um, don't forget, everyone, that Worlds Collide is going to be this coming Sunday. Check it out, everybody. Also, guys, um, AEW's All Out pay per view that's gonna be on Sunday as well. Check that out, everybody. That's all that you, you need to know. Also, guys, other news, by the way. Um, I want to say, brother, wish out to Keanu Reeves, Salma Hayek, Mark Harmon, Allison Miller, Lennox Lewis, Eric Dickerson, Jimmy Connors, Terry Bradshaw, Ella Ann Toon, Zed, Cat Williams, Liberty Poole, Lala Kent, Brandon Ingram, Patrick Clown, Selena Johnson. Harvey Levin of um, TMZ, Nigel Jones, Marcus Black, Damson, Idris, Merritt Patterson, and Mark Marcus and Marquise Morris, Paris Nicole. You got Montana Cox, Allison Miller, and Shayla Worley. Send them all your birthday wishes. Shout out sweets. We should do some there, everybody. That's all the news you need to know on that. And that's all I can say. So that's all you need to know, everybody. That's all I can say on that. And uh, that's everything there is you got to know. All right, ladies and that's going to do right there for the Clue Level Sports Board. Like, subscribe to the Clue Level Sports Board YouTube channel, Facebook page by any and all. Also, also, guys, this is one of the news I want to get you guys into. Dark Spine Sonic is going to be coming September 15th. Yes, everyone, that um, Dark Spine Sonic is arriving to Sonic Force Speed Battle September 15th, guys, through the, through the 24th. So that's everything that you got to know on that. Those of you guys who are wondering, Dark Spine Sonic from Sonic and Secret Rings, he's going to be coming to Sonic Force Speed Battle. And September 15th through the uh, 24th. That's all that you got to know on that. And uh, that's all I can say. So, that's, that's and, and hopefully it comes to Sonic Dash, Sonic Dash Plus, by the way, too, as well. So, that's all that you got to know on that. Hope you guys saw the Sonic Frontiers overview trailer, by the way. It's looking really good. Pre orders are, are right now, by the way, guys. It'll, and, and the game will be on November 8th. So, that's all there, there, there is you got to know on that. That's all I can say. Check it out, everybody. That's all that you got to know. So, is there anything that you got to know, everybody, on that? So, everything that you, there is you got to know. All right, ladies, that's going to do it right there for the Sports. We'll like to subscribe to the Sports. We'll YouTube channel, Facebook, by any numbers. What do you thought of Don Mitchell going to the cast? Let me know about that, but I'll address the response to that. You thought of Marcus May arrested him and charged for aggravated assault with a firearm from a road rage incident he got into? Let me know about that. What do you thought of Marcus May we waiting him? What do you thought of Cast of Insurance celebrating their 36th birthday and, and text that at H on Nightclub? Let me know about that. I'll just response to that. And um, we've done some Paige Becker's return to the for 2023-24. Still loving about that, but I'll address the sponsor, sure. Thoughts Serena Williams, Venus Williams wiped out with the women's doubles at the 2020 U.S. Summer. Loving about that. So your brother wishes out to um, Keanu Reeves, Salma Hayek, Mark Harmon, Allison Miller, Lennox Lewis, Eric Dickerson, Terry Bradshaw, Jimmy Connors, Ella Antoon, Zed, Kai Williams, Lala Ken, Liberty Poole, Brandon Ingram, Patrick Cloud, Selena Johnson, Harvey Lamb, TMZ, Nigel Jones, Marcus Black, Damson Idris, Mary Patterson, Mark, Marcus Marquis Morris, Paris Nicole, Montana Cox, Allison Miller, Shayla Worley. Some of my birthday wishes shall sweet them every, once again. Please do so in that. So this, don't forget, guys, that um, Clash of the Castles tomorrow. And also, don't forget that uh, Worlds Collide is on Sunday. And also, All, All Out is going to be on Sunday night as well. Check that out, guys. I'll tell you, you know. I'm back from breaking news during Thomas Levin. They're doing so much, and that's all that you got to know. Everybody, it's all I can say. Happy college college day, everybody. So, take care, you guys. You guys have a good weekend. Please be safe with it.